Hello everyone and welcome back. And this will be a general weekly reading for the sign of Libra for the week of March 17th. And I would like to give a very special thank you to everyone who has been subscribing to my channel and helping it grow and getting it noticed. And for all the thumbs up on the videos and all the lovely comments. Thank you very much for doing that. All right, Libra. Your first card out is the Two of Cups. Yeah. So this could be a new fella or woman coming into your life, a new partner. This could be a partnership and a job as well for some of you. Somebody that you really get along with. You know, there's a mutual attraction, a click. You just get along. Wow. This is a very good friend. This could be a material partner. This could be the rekindling of a, a relationship that you're already in. But it's opened your eyes up to how much you really connect with one another. And the Nine of Pentacles. Yeah, money. You're looking for rewards for your fruits of your labor. You want more luxury. You want self-satisfaction. You want your finances in order. And you're taking the steps. You know, sometimes you need to do this on your own. You're realizing that, okay, I have enough, but I want it to be more smoothly. I want it to happen more easily. So you're taking those steps. And right now, you know, maybe you're keeping to yourself a little bit more. Maybe you're, you know, staying at home a little bit more, watching what you're doing, that sort of thing. And you're content to do so. It's not like you're really missing out on anything. You just want time alone to reflect on what your choices are. And the Six of Swords. For many of you, you're really tempted to move. You know, move on to calmer shores, clean up what's behind you, you know, leaving things behind, releasing um, excess baggage letting things go from your past and moving on to better calmer shores. Maybe you've gotten a job offer for some of you somewhere totally new and you're really thinking about not only switching jobs, but moving there. So, you know, on to calmer shores where you're more appreciated and it's going to give you more money and, you know, set yourself free much sooner in life. So you're not only tempted, but you're actually going to do it. You know, this is your opportunity. You realize it's a big move, but it's one that has great rewards for yourself. And look at that. Look at that. Abundance, security, wealth. Things are really starting to open up for you. You know, and you're understanding that your accomplishments of growth is because of the efforts you put in. For some of us, this could be a new addition to the family as well. You know, a new project that's getting off to a new start. Your health is starting to return. You're just starting to feel more like spring is in the air. You know, that sort of thing. It makes you feel warm on the inside as the outside. You can step outside and start to appreciate what it is that you have in your life. And Mother Nature has that way of doing that for all of us. And the Queen of Pentacles, yeah, you're watching your money for sure, watching your garden grow, your bank accounts. You know, you have an idea of what it is you want to dip your toe into now in order to have better finances in the future. So you're working very hard to clear things up from your past, no matter what it is, and cutting your... Um, expenses you know watching your business start to grow because there's something you want to get off the ground and you're realizing that you know you have to spend a little less to make a little more and you're looking for the best bargains out there and the three of cups yeah celebrations friendships this could be um some you're getting a job or that in a place that you fit in they make you feel welcome, you're appreciated, and you know it. You know, a community that speaks to you. Or this could be a celebration as in, you know, um, 
an invitation to go to a celebration. Maybe somebody's celebrating something significant in their life and, and they want you to be a part of it. Somebody that you hadn't seen in a while. And when you go, it's going to make you feel like you've come back home. You're just happy and, and things are starting to show light in a more happy moment for yourself. So you're letting your hair down and enjoying yourself. Maybe you haven't done that in a while. And the Five of Swords, yeah, there's been some disagreements, a little bit of conflict. You know, it's, something's been a little bit difficult lately for you, you know, but you don't want to win at all costs, but you don't want to keep being harassed and feeling like you're not, you know, getting any farther ahead. And so, you know, whether this is in a relationship or a job or a family can be all of the above. And you're taking strides for yourself now. You're understanding, you're nurturing yourself. You need to stand up for yourself, you'll do it. If you need to tell somebody to stop, you'll do it. And the moon card, yeah, which in turn changes a lot of things in your life. You know, when you change the rules and how people feel they're entitled to talk or treat you, you know, it changes everything in your life. In most cases, in a very good way. You know, it stops you from having sleepless nights and wondering if you're making the right decisions. You know, it stops you from overeating, over drinking, in some cases, you know, taking substances. You're taking care of yourself. You're getting in control of what it is that you want in your life and you're taking the path it's not the path of least resistance. It's the path that's truly meant for you. You're helping yourself. You're listening to your intuitions and you're moving forward. And look at that. The high priestess. Beautiful. This is somebody who's very knowledgeable. You know, somebody you can truly trust. They've been through a lot. They listen to you. They try not to judge you and you feel secure within them. Like when you go to talk to them or you don't have to go and visit them. This could be somebody on the phone, you know, somebody you haven't seen in a while and you sort of, you know, just appreciate them. And this is you understanding that this is unlimited potential to you. You know, there's something that you want to get going and you're going to do it. You're Got your head in the right place this time. You know it. You're very, very secure within yourself, what it is that you're bringing into your life, what you're accepting. And you're realizing that you can bring this all into your life because the potential is there. So that's beautiful. And there you are. The Queen of Wands. Potential, moving forward. And you always have that. You know, you just understand that what it is when you put your mind to something what you're willing to do you know you'll sacrifice what it is you have to sacrifice you're taking the manager position in this area but you're changing things because you can see with as you're changing that it's bringing a light of its own a life to itself of good potentials in your life and you're telling yourself the truth you're not you know, sugarcoating anything. You're taking very bold moves for yourself going forward. And the magician, look at that. <laughs> if there's been a difficult challenge, you know, you remind yourself that you're focused. You're understanding what it is you have to do to create something and you're taking those steps. You know, you're realizing nothing is impossible. Everything is possible you know, and you're moving forward. You realize your own true potential this week and you're tapping into it. You're accomplishing so many good things for yourself and you're realizing that the unlimited potential out there is within reach and you're definitely reaching for it. And the Wheel of Fortune, yeah. This could be a lottery win for some of this. You know, this is a very lucky card in Terra. And, you know, more money, higher rate of pay, better career. You know, better career is in more money, less work. You know, you're being paid very handsomely for what the efforts you put in. And it's turning. 
and it's going in your favor very quickly. And the Six of Pentacles. Yeah, you're no longer allowing people to just give you little tidbits here and there. You're understanding that for everything you've put out and given help to, it needs to be returned. And that's where you're headed. And people are starting to realize that and accept it about you. All right, I'm going to shuffle and deal you an Angel Orca. But you're changing your whole new life here for yourself you've understood where you're going from what it is you want to bring into your life and what it takes to get there all right you are protected from all types of harm the worst is now behind you i ask you to relax and feel safe perfect and on that note i will say goodbye for now don't forget to subscribe to my channel and i'll talk to you again next week Bye for now.